Here we go, we've just arrived. Number three, Rowan Court. I forgot where we are. Where are we? <laughs> Mabel I know we're at Mablethorpe. What's it called? <laughs> we're I at Avonside. Yeah, Avonside at Mablethorpe. We forgot where it's called. I have to put her on after. Go on then, let's go in and have a look. I wonder what it's like. <laughs> Here, give me that. Oh, no. This is another Avon bronze caravan. Ooh. I've got the telly there, so it's similar to the last one we had actually. Mm. Turn the eating right up. Yeah. Big fridge freezer. That's the fridge freezer below. That's switched on. Here we go. Cooker, grill, and the hob. And the microwave. Oh. Toaster kettle. Let's have a look what's down here. I think it looks like we've got the extra bedroom. There's one. And this side, you've got the toilet. Broom cupboard again. <laughs> I like going in there. There's the second bedroom there. So this must be the shower and toilet. Yeah, so there is two toilets in this caravan. Yeah, standard shower. Plenty of room. Quite good. And then we've got one door left. This must be the double bed in here. There we go. Air dryer. Looks like two air dryers. I don't know what that's about. Yeah, it all looks neat and tidy. Eh? This will do us for a few days. Another cheap deal. Get the uh, eating full on. USB socket there. Yeah, it took us another 20 minutes or more to get here because the roads are closed all over the place and we ended up going all over the walls. We didn't really know where we were, to be honest. I definitely won't go back that way. Uh, the main complex is just at the front of us here. So we're in a pretty good spot really. We can see through this window. Cook's traditional fish and chips. Mini market's just there. Yeah, not a bad spot. Well, we're here now, and we're getting sorted out. First job, wash all the cutlery and plates, and knives and forks. Crazy, but that's what we do. Wendy's just sorting the bedroom stuff out, and clothes. I'm not laying on the bed. No, no. Let's get a cup of tea. <coughs> no, uh, yeah, I want that other one.
your milk in first for the coffee. You get in trouble. Notice one thing when we have a caravan, I like that bloke on East Enders, the one who shuffles family business. I can always put that out later. Mm. Busy outdoor stage. It keeps blowing over rainy though, so not gonna be many sitting outside drinking today. That was the arcade in there. Papa John's and Burger King. They don't look a bad sight this don't. They've got some good acts on here apparently tonight. It's Seal. Here's the activity hub. That aerial adventures looks quite good. And here's the climbing and the kids. Everything seems to be short, but no surprise really, is it? It is just November. Where? The blue one. Blimey, we thought this was a go-kart track. Look at the state of it. You'd lose your kids in there, look. Well, what's it say on here? Tank off roaders. Oh my God. <laughs> Well, I bet that's pretty good, really. There's crazy golf. And they've got an elephant, look. I'll tell you what, it's getting a bit colder out here, but I wouldn't have thought it's that cold. Poor old elephant, it's blue. A bike hire and loads of go-karts here. Music again. I've been pleased to not climb over the fence lot. They're worried you might hurt you, but surely if you jump off that and that's flat, that's going to hurt, isn't it? Well, we're at the Queen's Park. This is Queen's Park Close. This is, I think it's still Mablethorpe. Could be Trustthorpe. I think it's Mablethorpe. Where well, you bring the kids anyway. You see the beach huts and the sea's just over that wall. Let's go that way in a minute. A bit windy. Well, first day in November today, so not surprisingly, the paddling pool's empty. And boats are all tied up, look, and swans. Wow, it's very quiet. Is. Charlie's favourite place. Yeah. It's a bit warmer there. <laughs> Crazy golf in the Queen's Park, Pavilion Cath. It's windy. Oh, we're on the seafront. Funnily enough, there's not many people about. 
I don't know why they're not sunbathing just because it's blowing a gale. See front here, the wind's coming off the land. You can see not many people about the price of rise. See down there the RNLI flag. The wind's coming off the land. Just as well, it'd be really rough. There's a ship out there. Funnily enough, I can't see it through the camera. As you say, not many people. Walk a bit further. Well, the sun's out. We've not walked far, but the sun's come out and it's turned a lot warmer. There's one or two people about, look, sitting enjoying the sea. Not many people as you walk down here. How are you, Wendy? Fine. All right. Okay. okay. <laughs> A bit further. One thing about Mablethorpe and Skegness, there's always plenty of beach, look. We've been here, sat here all day when it's red hot. And it's all right here, kids love it. We loved it, the kids loved it. As you come around this corner, look at the beach down there. And that's, this, in the summer, there's a land train comes along here. Takes you right to our site. Here's the crazy golf. It's not too bad if you get out of the wind, it's nice and sunny. Wendy's taking a photo, look. Nice spot for a little family holiday, really. I think that bloke's like spying on me. Thought we'd better sit and look at the sea for a few minutes, seeing as it's so nice. It's quite nice here. I'll tell you know what, I don't know that I'm getting old, but these old shelters were good, weren't they, really? Windy down this yeah. way. Sorry. Yeah, there's a lot of waves in there. Look at them breaking over. Looks a bit rough out at sea. No doubt it's rougher the further you get out because it's blowing off the land. It's got to be at least a force five. That is, could be six. Yeah, a bit rough. There's the Blitz Tea Room in Mablethorpe. Oh dear, it looks shut down. Maybe it's not. Let's have a look. It's still open. Here's what they sell in this World War II cafe. When you notice, look, spam. Camp coffee, look. <laughs> well, I can't be bad. Bubbling squeak. There's all sorts here. Loads of memorabilia in here. <laughs> nice spot. <laughs> oh yeah.
Camp Coffee. Well, there we are in Mablethorpe, looking around the crap shops. They're a bit crap, but I'll tell you what, mate, that is a rainbow, isn't it? It's starting to fade, actually. I'm a bit late, but... Lovely jubbly. We have actually just been to Trotter's Trading. Oh, we're back in the Queen's Park now. We've had a nice walk around. Look at that lovely sky. It's beautiful. Trouble is, that's what's coming. Boy, it's gonna rain. Get back. Just made it back to the car in time. I tell you what, when we arrived. There are about four motor homes parked along here. It must be a bit of a, a wild camping spot. Let's say this is Victoria Park. Anyway, the good news is we got back just as it started slinging it down. I just thought I'd take a little bit of video. It's a bright morning this morning. It's pretty good. But there's hardly anybody here because if you're in these caravans, this is where you have to park your car. And look, there's hardly anybody. There's a silver car there, they're in that caravan, and we're over here. But you see these, these other three cars here, they work here. So there's hardly anybody about, really, but it is November. But uh, it's been all right here, really. Yeah, not bad at all, really. Pretty good. And also, <coughs> got a bit of a cold. We'll walk down the back of the van. And you can see, there's hardly anybody about. These caravans, they're quite close together here, I think, really. But, you know, when it's dark, there's a light on down there. I can see a car. I've seen another light. But these vans along here, there's hardly anybody in them. Hardly anyone at all. Yeah, so I think there's one more week and then it closes. But you know, oh, there's a couple of cars down there. I think that's where I could see the lights as well. Mind you, don't look bad today. Not a bad sky look. Go and get a good walk around with a bit of luck. Yeah, we're gonna say how much this deal cost us, but you know. I can't remember. I think it was 80 odd pound for four nights. Oh yeah, it was. It worked out to about 21 pound 50 a night, I think it was, I said, because I said, you know, a lot of campsites for our caravan are that. You know, it's just, <laughs> it seems silly. So we'll just have another Avon caravan. It's not bad. It's all right, this one is, quite like it. Yeah, it's fairly clean, it's okay. And it's easy, isn't it? You just chuck your suitcase in the back of the car and off you go. It's a doddle.